we made it to Camera Castle. But first, what we're gonna do is that we're gonna rewind a bit to yesterday morning so you can like have the beginning of the story and know why we're here. Good morning and welcome to our first ever video. We wanted to make a video today because we are gonna do something we've never done before, which is uh, that we're gonna sleep in a castle. Uh, we're supposed to live in 10 minutes, but I'm still drinking my coffee and my hair is wet and Cyril is not ready either. So we'll see how that goes. This is our lovely car for the weekend. We got it from Yoko. How do you feel driving the other way of the road? I still hate it. <laughs> After two years in Ireland, you still hate it? Yeah, it's terrible. Amazing. Where do we go? I don't know. We have 40. 42. Okay, good. Start. So we arrived here at New Grange. New Grange. New, New Grange. Sorry. Um, uh, to visit before we go to the castle. You can see it up there. The problem is that we didn't have tickets and due to COVID you need to order tickets in advance. But we made it. Uh, we ordered some and now we're gonna go in. County Meath? Meath? County Meath? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Probably not funny. Before we go to the castle, uh, we are visiting one of the largest passage tombs in the world. We are actually going to visit two sites. That's the first one. These hills, well, actually, this one has the world, no, the Western European? Yeah, the, the largest art collection from the Neolithic in Western Europe. So it's a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Yeah. And this site is called Nox and it has one huge one with the art collection in it and 17 satellite tombs around it. And it's super impressive like how well built it is for, I mean, 3200 BC. Uh, so yeah, it's, it's crazy impressive. Yeah, so, so it's super old. It's older than the pyramids, uh, which I find hugely impressive that it's still standing. It's still waterproof actually, um, so nothing drops inside. Um, you can normally go inside, not today because of COVID, but it's a very impressive site. We are now in the second site and it's much much bigger than the first one as you can see look at all these white stones it is massive it looks so cool what we learned is these white stones they're actually from Wicklow mountain which is like an hour drive away and they transported it here by boat, boat or river. like on, on the river somehow mm -hmm. the reason they took them is because they have like a nice flare and a nice reflection when the sun is on them. Uh, what it was used for this whole tomb was like for ceremonies. They are not sure if they also buried the people here. They only found five people. They say inside there is a massive cathedral. And the little, little like more grayish like kind of stones that you can see. It is said that it, it was a symbol of fertility. So. We're almost there. We are still in County Meath for now, but we should cross to County Cavan soon. So is still focused driving on the very small country roads of Ireland.
so we made it to our hotel room and we're gonna give you now a quick room tour. So we have a very big room, like it's huge, I didn't think it would be that big. Uh, with like a sofa and like this kind of like lounge-ish thingy from the old times and a super comfy bed, like very comfy, so that's nice. And we have a bathroom with a bathtub, which I'm very happy about. Um, it looks so like old school, like H E and, and nice. And this as well looks very pretty with the marble. And the, I love the shape of the mirror. Super nice. And we have also like a very old style um, like toilet with like the flush that is with this. And then you pull it, you pull on it, and then it flushes down. That's our room. We're gonna go get snacks now and explore the castle. We found the coolest room to hang out afterwards. I'm having a massive kind of avo toast on sourdough. Super nice. This castle itself has an amazing architecture. Every room is so different and so nicely decorated. It really feels like you're like a, from the royalty, you know, <laughs> and you're just hanging there. <laughs> Hello, my love. Ah! I'm waiting for you. Lots of things to do actually. We played chess in the gardens of the castle. So there is one more thing you can do in this castle. It's if you're an artist and like me. You have to do it. <laughs> Look at me. about this castle is it's empty I mean look at this there's no one no one nowhere there's me <laughs> we have the whole castle for ourselves it's so cool no there are some people out here look but yeah we are mainly alone I love that On our second day and today we're first gonna get some delicious breakfast now and then we're gonna play tennis and afterwards we're gonna explore the castle estate or better said the castle forest <music> in the castle, like around the castle, and very, very nice.
for the little hidden gem. Show us around, honey. Well, this must be very cute at night actually because it's like surrounded by little lights. It's like a, a love kiosk or something. <laughs> and then what's there? I don't know. Oh, I think it's the way to the cottages. Because in the hotel you can sleep in the castle, but you can also sleep in, you can rent like cottages and things like that. And I think that's the way to, to the cottages. Yeah. It looks like Alice in Wonderland. Then. So we're actually finished here. Uh, we're gonna check out now. Um, no, we're gonna shower first. We're gonna shower first. Right, then we're gonna check out and then we're gonna explore the, the castle estate. Uh, which apparently uh, is supposed to have a very nice forest with like kind of fairy tale nature. So we're very excited for this. So we are now in the forest of uh, dinosaurs. <laughs> <laughs> did, you, did you hear that? Yeah. Um, it actually looks even like a dinosaur. You know those ones with the very long neck? neck? I don't know the name in English. I don't know it in German either. <laughs> Anyways, uh, we're here and we're gonna do a little walk now. Let's go. like in a fairy tale. We are still searching this one wonderful bridge and it's hard to find but we'll make it there. I think in the whole forest there are like four possible paths that you can take and we took three of them and we didn't see the bridge yet but now we're taking the last one so we, we gotta find it um, let's see let's hope Above this little river, Sarah and it's called Sarah Bridge. Yeah. Just like this, we made it back home to Dublin. We are in our lovely city. Yeah, it was such a nice weekend. So thank you very much for watching, and we're soon gonna go on another adventure in another country actually so if if we can fly if everything works yeah but let's stay positive so thank you very much for watching and see you next time bye bye